Hey, kindergarten, first and second grade. You are the lucky folks who do not take the PSSA. So I have a design challenge for you. This is going to be the hardest design challenge yet. So I have a couple of things I want to share with you. One of them is the tools that you're going to have this week. Two tools. You're going to have 20 popsicle sticks and you're going to have 10 rubber bands. And what you're going to be doing with these is you are going to be creating a catapult. Now I have attached two videos for you. One explains how a catapult works as um, a simple machine called a lever. And the second video is going to help if you aren't sure how to build your catapult. So um, I, before you get started looking at the new or the videos that are attached, I wanted to talk to you about rubber bands. Um, I know some of my little guys are having some troubles with the rubber bands. So I wanted to give you a little lesson on how to wrap a rubber band. So I'm going to grab some popsicle sticks. And I'm just going to put them in a pile. Now I'm going to take my rubber band and I'm going to put it over my sticks. Then I'm going to twist it and put my sticks through. And I can just keep twisting and pushing it through until it's wrapped. Now, if you wrap it too many times and it gets too tight, then the rubber band could break. If it's too loose, then the rubber band will fall off and your sticks will fall apart. Now, uh, this catapult is, like I said, it's a little bit harder. The one, the video that I'm showing you on how to make a catapult, there are two different ways. You can choose one or both if you want to. That's your choice. And what I'd like to see is I'd like to see a picture or a video of your catapult. Um, seeing your catapult working would be super cool. I made a catapult here, but I don't think mine would work very well. I wonder if you could look at this and tell me why you think my catapults would not work very well. So what I did was I stacked up my popsicle sticks. Then I opened this and I put a popsicle stick through and then I wrapped rubber bands on the ends. Then I took another popsicle stick and I put it over the top and I rubber banded it here. Okay. Now, if we're talking about that lever, this is going to be my fulcrum, the stack of sticks. And I'm going to push down and let go. And my entire popsicle stick just flew off. So I guess that explains that my catapult is not working. So I want you to try your own catapult. I obviously failed my design challenge. So I need to go back and I need to take a look at this and figure out where's my design problem. I think it might be, I have too many popsicle sticks, but I don't know. I'll have to go back to my drawing board and find out. If you have any questions, send me an email or a message through the Google Classroom. If you need any tools, please let me know and I can have those ready for Friday pickup. And I am super duper excited to see your catapults.